Today we're going to make these dip dyed wooden spoons. These are a fun and easy way to plus up your next kid's birthday party or baby shower or backyard barbecue. And it's an easy enough project that the kids can help you. It's super fun. We're going to need these wooden spoons, which you can buy online or at a party store. Gel food coloring. And it's important that you use the gel, not the liquid drops, because the gel is more concentrated. A pitcher of water, some glasses or bowls to mix your colors in, and a cookie sheet or a tray lined with paper towels for drying the spoons. First, we're going to pour a couple inches of water into each glass. Next, we're going to add several drops of the gel food coloring to each glass. And it might take a little experimentation to see how concentrated you want the color to be, because that will affect how intense the color is on the spoons when you dip them. There's a couple of different ways we can do this. If you start with a wet spoon, then it's going to have a nice soft gradual fade of color. If you start with a dry spoon, it's going to be a harder line and more of a color blocked effect. If you want the softer fade, then you can just soak your spoons in water for a few minutes before you start. I'm going to do the dry spoon today. All right, now for the fun part. We're just going to dip the spoons in the color. And you can play around with some different techniques here. Um, you can dip it once and then let it dry for a minute and then dip it again in the color and have kind of a gradual layering of colors. Or you can just leave them all sitting in there for a few minutes if you want the colors to be really bright and intense. Or you can even try dipping it in one color and then dipping it in another and blending the colors. There's not really any rules, just play around and have fun and see which techniques work for you and give you the look that you're liking. I should also mention that if you want to dye the entire spoon or just the bottom, you totally can because it's food safe dye. You can do whatever you like. It'll probably take you a little time to figure out which techniques are working for you, but just take your time and play around. It's kind of like color therapy. And we're just going to let them sit out to dry. They'll need about an hour. And now they're ready for the party. Don't they look so sweet? Mm. Thank you.